me and the wifey on our way to the grocery store. To go get them good groceries. You know, Chef Stanley, good grocery man. Stay tuned. Good, good eats, good love, good life, good family. Yeah, peace out. Well, yeah, honey, say peace to the people. You know I gotta have my helper with me. My trusty and sturdy helper. My lovely and beautiful wife. How you doing, honey? All right, let me tell y'all what the meal gonna be today. My wife is actually peeling the shrimp uh, at the moment. Uh, I decided to go uh, the easy way and buy me some uh, cut seasoning. When I do that, ladies and gentlemen, Gidrich, man. Gidrich is the, is the way to go. All right, this is what I use. Uh, well, anyway, the meal will be, I'll take these uh, sweet peppers, we're going to stuff those with uh, some, an oyster, cream cheese, a uh, few other cheeses and bread from uh, stuffing, we'll throw those on the grill, I'll season those shrimp, and uh, we're going to skewer them and put those on the grill as well, uh, I have a couple of uh, pieces of red fish, actually store bought red fish, uh, my family's not a big fan of fish, but I am going to go ahead on and put that on the grill as well. Uh, and I have a sauce that I'm going to make, uh, a crab meat sauce that I'm going to make and put over the top of that. Uh, I'll let you know what that uh, consists of when I, when I get to it. Uh, the main course of the meal will be uh, some white beans, what I actually great white northerns, great northern for me. And uh, the meat that will go into the beans will be actually some pigtails, so white beans and pigtails. Little fish and a uh, grilled shrimp on the side. And just as an appetizer, we're gonna go ahead on and have us some oyster stuffed uh, sweet peppers. So that's the gist of it, ladies and gentlemen. When we uh, get the meal together and all through the course, we'll get back with y'all and chime in. Other than that, y'all have a blessed day. Howdy bye. We love you. All right, folks, listen, what I'm doing about seafood. Uh, I, I like to use a lot of different seasonings during my cooking, but when I'm cooking seafoods, these, this is one of my favorite uh, seasonings, right? Uh, that's the relative Cajun seasoning. This is actually the uh, the fire department blend, the magic swap dust seasoning. Hey, this is some good stuff, especially when you're doing seafood. It has a, a, a limited taste to it. It's pretty darn good. You need to check it out. Good stuff here. Uh, and as well, if I'm using any breadcrumbs with my seafood, Quite naturally, I mean, the bread crumb got to be press, progresso, right? It's the best in the business. All right, we'll get back with you in a minute, and I'll show you the seasonings and the blends that we use for my cooking, and uh, hope you can uh, come out with the same results. Thank you, man. Take these peppers, I'm pouring these peppers out, and we're going to stuff them with some, uh, with a oyster and cream cheese and some other things, uh, filling. So what I do is I cut it here, cross the top, the sides and around the sides the meat here get the top off all right cut them all the way through we'll pull the top off of that and we'll cut out the core and the stuff that we don't want in the inside i mean you can do these with jalapenos or whatever i'm doing them actually with with sweet peppers uh just like the taste of the sweet peppers I'm not a real fan of jalapenos unless we're doing uh, something that calls for the hot stuff. But when it comes to seafood, these are better. All right, see that? See what we got there? All right, and we got this to cover it right on back up, right? Bam. There you go. It's back perfect. All right, we'll come back with uh, step two of this in a second. All right, so this is uh, my uh, stuffing. Yeah, which is uh, oysters, cheese, breadcrumbs, a few other seasonings, and that is actually going to go into uh, this pepper right here. There you go. Stuff that on down up in there like that. Make sure it's all nice and even. All right, and we're going to come back and, uh, excuse me, we're going to go ahead on and Place the top of the pepper back on there. See that, ladies and gentlemen? Just that simple. Go on and stick that over to the side. 
And uh, we're gonna continue to do that with all the peppers until they are actually, uh, actually stuck. All right, so uh, once again, so we'll take a pepper with the cheese and the oysters and whatnot. Uh, go on, put that on down up in there. Just a little bit of that uh, filling as well, put that on in there. Add in that pepper rice. Good uh, I don't have on any gloves, ladies and gentlemen, because uh, I beat myself with my family, so y'all got to worry about it. All right, that's the chest of it, right? We'll be back. Well, y'all know, uh, it don't start with me. We got that pit going. We doing uh, some midnight, a uh, late night, not midnight, midnight cookout. That's my pit going for my, uh, my peppers and my oysters and my fish and my shrimp. To go along with those white beans we cooking. Yeah, that's how we come. You see me? We are all in the nighttime. I got my light hooked up. Got my prick going. Yeah. And and I got the beautiful and uncomparable. Mike can't see her back there. You're black as midnight back there. We can't see nothing. Get on over there by the light, honey, so we can see the incomparable and the beautiful. My happiness right now. We love you, baby. Love you, too. That, that, no, oh, yeah, you see, you see this pit going. I need to, I need for y'all to see something. You see, I got a hot side, and we got a cool side. All right? If you notice, my cool side has my uh, fall paper on it. All right? So that way, I'm on that side, she ain't doing nothing but a little cooking, a little smoking. All, right? all the grill marks and all should be done on this side. That's for you amateurs. Y'all figure it out. Yeah, they're getting bad. Don't worry about that smoke going run them. All right, we off the grill. And we about done with those beans. Go ahead on and show y'all what we got going on. All right, that's them beans right there. That's the beans right there. Give me a, give me a, uh, a ladle, honey. Let me show what them beans do. That's them old white beans right there. With the pigtails. Y'all see that? You see that right there? Oh man, y'all know nothing about that. That's because you're cooking. All right, so I'm going on and show y'all some of that old red fish. Now that's that old red fish. See underneath all that old crab meat and those shrimps that been on the grill. Right, that have been on that grill, that's like, oh yeah. Those peppers in there too, those stuffed oysters that I had. Yeah, look at that. You see, you see them over there? Kind of in the condos and all over the place. All right, now, look, look here, look here. See that right up? That's that oyster cake. Yeah, you see that little thing I put in that, uh, in that cup looking deal? Yeah. All right, that's that oyster cake. Man. Look at that, that, that boy. Y'all see them peppers through that? Now you tell me that ain't Chef Stan, the good grocery man. Now let me show you about the beans, now. We ain't got no beans. You gotta have some beans, you know what I mean? Look at that. Boy, if this was smell of vision Hey, yo, boy. Yeah, that's ball, that's ball off the bone right there. Look at that. Hold up, let me get over that close. Ooh, boy, that's milk like water. Ooh, it don't take much. Y'all yeah. yeah. know nothing about that. What's some good old rice? That is. Now you know I gotta gotta have my toast to what I do. Good old red wine with some seafood always run through. Yeah. And my help over here. What's here? Let's see. Charlie, you in, the, you in the mix? Hoping I drop something? Now, Charlie. What up, Charlie? Why? I see you. What's, my, what's up, my helper? What's up, my? We ready to enjoy this meal? The camera down. Ready? That is, right. 